What a time it is. You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. Where is it at? Right there or there? I never know. And it's time to follow my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. Same on Twitter. And it's time to get this reaction video started. both the Disney World and Disneyland parks. I've been to all the Disney World, the Emmy Animal Kingdoms and the Epcot and the Magical Kingdom and the Hollywood Studios. And I've been to both on Disneyland, the, the, the Disneyland part and then the other part that, that I never remember the name of, DCA, Disney California Adve Adventure. Is that it, right? Especially the scary rides, because I like scary. I do. I love roller coasters. I love the, my, one of my favorite rides was the Tower of Terror, when they bring you up and they drop you and all that. But I went this past weekend when I attended the D23 Expo and I went to Disneyland, I went to the Pixar Village. What is it called? The Pixar, the Pixar Pier, right? I've been to the Pixar Pier. I've done the Incredibles coaster before, loved it. I've done some of the other rides in there. But this past weekend was the first time I ever rode that Ferris wheel. Get some swing in there. Okay. We're in this, what is this called again, Amy? <laughs> Pixar Pals. And we're in a, it's a Ferris wheel, but this thing is like in it's motion. A swinging gondola. The Pixar Pal around. Number one, this name's deceiving. There ain't nothing pal about this ride, nothing. Now, let me tell you a little bit more what this ride's about. It's a regular Ferris wheel. Uh, you, you walk through the pier. It looks beautiful. It has Mickey's face. Looks so inviting. Oh, there's Mickey's face. The pal around. Let me go pal around. And they, and they market it. Get the best views in the park on the pal around. And some of them you can. Some of you can because there's two options you can take on this pal around. There's a nine moving side. And those are the normal type of, you know, you ride that ride contraptions that just stay still and you go in there and you sit in the little benches in the in the cave and you go around in the circle and you take in all the views and then there's the moving side i went with my friend we were in the line our other friends were like oh y'all scaredy cats they were y'all are scaredy cats we going on the, the moving side this gonna be fun right our line was super long Oh yeah, they're talking about 45 minute wait times and all this. I'm like, I don't want to wait up on this for the Ferris wheel this long. Well, they were over in the line and they were all, ooh, I'm only 20 minutes, less than that. We almost to the front. So I was like, fine. My friend bailed here. They were like, no, I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. He was the smart one. He was the smart one because I went over there and joined my friends on the other one. <sighs> Let me tell you first what they do, right? You get in your little your little contraption. They you got two benches on each side. You're in a cage and a caged contraption thing, right? Number one, there's no locks on this cage contraption. The girl got up there. She just opened it, just like that. So these things can slide open at any time. No locks on it. Nothing. It didn't have no sealed locks or doors. No. She just slide it back and forth like this. Number one. Number two, we sit on a bench, right? We're sitting on this bench, and there's no seatbelts on this bench. No, you're just sitting there. There's nothing to hold you down. There's nothing to hold on to. If you hold on to something on the side, you're holding on to that door. Like any Ferris wheel, you gotta, you're gonna have to load everybody. So you're gonna have your, you get on, you go up like one, right? You go up one, then more people load. Then you go up another and more people load. Well, the higher we got up, it started getting scary. I think my friends was trying to move it on me, right? I think I'm like, y'all trying to shake it and move it. Because when we got a little higher, it slid, right? And right there, we're like, whoa, whoa, this is scary, right? It's, I feel it sliding. I don't, I want to do, I want to ride with new people. How many people have died on this so far? I want to ride with new people. I relate that in the name of Jesus. Like only four people have died on this ride total. Stop it's it. Okay. What I need the worst of it, because we're still stationary as this thing is sliding on this. We're still, so why it's a little scary at that time, it eventually stops the sliding. And it don't slide much. You just slide and you're like, woo, right? Well, when everybody's loaded, it's going to take its turn. It's going to take its big turn and not stop. I don't even remember how many, it felt like it took 20, 30, 
hundred turns when we was on this thing. Because when this thing got going, this thing not only started to slide, but it started to like slide and and go uh, like you know what that car that ride the matador when it's like this it's like a boat and then the further you get you're gonna and then you eventually go upside down well this thing started sliding and it started going sideways like this on each side sideways so you're sliding like this at a ungodly speed going sideways they don't got no seatbelts on this. They don't got nothing to hold down. I feel like I'm going to fly out of this thing. I'm going sideways. I have never, like, I've screamed. I like to scream on rides. If it's fun, I'm like, woo, yeah. I screamed bloody murder on this ride. Ah! like that my life was about to end and I'm running from somebody attacking me with a knife or something trying to kill me that's how I felt Stop it. y'all are doing this on purpose I've never been so scared on a ride and I was even trying to hold on I didn't even think about those doors how they open until I'm trying to hold on and and the other people with me like no that's gonna open the door so I'm like what am I supposed to hang on to I'm about to die here yeah, can you can't get me off <laughs> I don't like it <laughs> this is the worst ride in the place <laughs> one more time all right it's it only twice we have to go around we, almost, <laughs> we were sideways side of this because it's less time there's a reason there's less time on this what were they thinking number one not to have any kind of seat belts or things to hold on to after this ride we went on this ride called what is it the the inside out the imagineers or something and it's a kitty ride right oh. they play songs and it goes up and down real slow and it's just fun that's uh that that even had seat belts in it this you could probably stand up and jump out the ride and land on your feet and be and walk away just fine. This one, that even had seatbelts. They was checking to make sure you're secure. And then they put me on this death trap ride with no seatbelts and nothing to hang on to. I don't know what they're thinking about Pixar, Piers, D Disneyland, Disney California Adventures. But y'all need to change some things because I will never go in that again. And I'm a warn people. You see in the footage. Don't do it to yourselves. If you've been on this ride, you let me know what you think. Comments, thumbs, all that. Till next time, y'all.